In 2010, Pech was the European capital of culture. And it continues to be that today. In the past decade, Page has carried out a cultural investment with a scope it had never seen before. As a result, a network of municipal institutes around the city has been created under the name of Jornai Heritage Management Non-Profit Company. This undertaking is exemplary on a national level and guarantees that locals and visitors alike can find enticing programmes and curiosities. Now let's take a step back 1,600 years into the past. In the heart of the city centre, we can see the World Heritage Site. This is the unique ancient world of Sopiani. A UNESCO World Heritage Site since 2000 and a Hungaricum, the site of the 4th century ancient Christian burial tombs and chambers and the Sela Septacora Visitor Centre can be found here. Nearby, between the cathedral and the city wall, we can visit a monument from a thousand years later, the building complex of the medieval university. According to the excavations, the first Hungarian university, founded in 1367, operated on this site, where today, medieval life can be experienced with the help of 21st century technology. On Széchenyi Square, the main square of Pécs, two important institutes can be found the House of Arts and Literature with the Martin Ferenc Attic Gallery and the atmospheric painted rooms, and the nearby Page Gallery, which for decades has been a representative venue for contemporary Hungarian artists to show their work. Only a few minutes' walk from the city centre is the Kodai Concert and Conference Centre, one of the prominent facilities of the cultural capital of Europe investments. Built with a budget of 8 billion forints, the centre was opened in December 2010 and was called an architectural Stradivarius by violinist Maxim Vangerov after the opening concert. Within years, the unique Alderwood Finnish Concert Hall has achieved international renown thanks to its excellent acoustics and services. Where music enthusiasts can enjoy classical, jazz and world music programmes. The artists that have performed at the centre have all spoken highly of the concert hall's attributes. The Kronos Quartet, Pat Metheny, Aldi Miola, Andrei Gavrilov, Jan Garberek, Zoltan Kocic, Malcolm Bilson, Felix Laiko, Fazil Say and Garbo Presso. The resident orchestra of the centre is the Panel Philharmonic. Since its opening in December 2010, over 350,000 visitors have attended more than 700 events at the centre, which has received several Hungarian and international awards for its unique architectural solutions. A few hundred metres from the Kodai centre is the 5.5 hectare Zsornai Cultural Quarter. With the help of funding received from the European Union and a result of an 11 billion foreign investment, a globally unique, architecturally brilliant establishment was created on the site of the former factory and the residence of the Jornai family. The 88 public ceramic sculptures decorating the parks, promenades and playgrounds and the 15 listed buildings with various individual functions are also in the list of Hungaricums. Attracting tens of thousands of visitors, our artistic and family oriented festivals have become very popular in just a short time. Our permanent exhibitions play a prominent role in our day-to-day -day operations. The earliest Jornai products, about 1,200 items, are showcased in the Pink Exhibition. One of these is Laszlo Dugy's collection, entitled The Golden Age of Jornai, which has returned from America and is comprised of 600 objects with an estimated value of 2 billion forints. These two are complemented by the Family and Factory History Exhibition. On a hill near the Cultural Quarter, visitors can see the Jornai Mausoleum in its original splendour. 42 lions guard the final resting place of the Jornai factory and the secret of the Eosin glaze. Occupying 1,200 square metres, the biggest gallery in the city, the Page Gallery M21, is located in the cultural quarter and is the venue for Hungarian and international artists to show their works. The E78 building is a multifunctional venue, not only for entertainment, but for programmes of public education as well, 
and it provides rehearsal and performance space for amateur musicians, choirs and dancers. From spring to autumn, Pyrogranite Courtyard, located next to the building, awaits audiences of all ages with open-air concerts and real parties. There are several interesting venues for children on the site of the quarter. The open-air playgrounds, the lab, interactive house of playful sciences, and the Bobita Puppet Theatre, with its puppet museum and arts and crafts workshops, all offering events attractive for children. The Planetarium has become a popular venue thanks to the scientific lectures given by our astronomers. It is important to note that the Faculty of Music and Visual Arts and some institutes of the Faculty of Humanities of the University of Peach are also located in this area. In the renovated buildings, young artists, painters, sculptors and ceramists live and breathe with the quarter. A unique architectural solution is the Arts Faculty Library, partly housed within the kilns of the former factory. The Janus University Theatre also found its home in the Jolnai Cultural Quarter. Beyond these spectacles, the products of local creative industry are also on offer in the street of shops of the Jolnai Cultural Quarter. Restaurants and cafes also welcome visitors. The guest house of the quarter has 13 apartments for visiting guests and artists. Page has always been a magical, historical city and its diverse landscapes, people and culture will surely serve visitors for a long, long time to come. <laughs>